Hi, I started a new project, but unfortunately it's not finished yet. As you can see, I just started to make drawings. So today we're gonna do the video with the old robot. I've made some modification to robot. So first of all, I added a cover for the electronics box. This is a better view. I also added some new end effectors. This is the old one. This is a holder for GoPro session. What is mounted? This is a kind of a spoon. Now let's see how this robot can be used in everyday life. And now, for example, you're at kitchen and you would like to turn on the light, but the switch is too far. So you can just open the app, click enable and click run. And the robot will do whatever you want. Nice! What is this? What is he doing? As a first example, I programmed this robot to feed me. Let's see how it works. Enable. Run. I have a nut and I can put it over here. Thank you, robot. And now imagine the standard situation. You are sitting in the toilet with your smartphone and with your iPad. And you would like to have a cup of tea. But to have a cup of tea, you need to go and turn on the kettle. But you cannot do this. You're sitting on the toilet. But what you can do, you can take your iPad, connect to the GoPro, take your smartphone, connect to the robot. And like this, you can see your robot and you can control it and you can switch on kettle or what to do whatever you want. Let's try this. So this is my first telepresence, telepresence from the toilet. And like this you can see your robot and you can control your robot. Thank you for watching this video till the end. Today we learned how to use uh, this robot arm in everyday life. If you have your ideas how to use this arm, please leave your comment. If you are new to my channel, please consider to subscribe to my channel. I publish a video once per week. And also please consider to support me via Patreon or on PayPal. All the links in the description and also I would like to say as usual a huge thank you to my Patreons. Here are their names. Thanks to them I built this project and thanks to them I will build more projects like this one or even better. See you next time.